It's like the whole fucking army against one. One V army. Let's go. Let's go. Want to fight? Get out of here. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of our Rise of the Tomb Raider playthrough. This is part number 34, possibly the finale to the main story campaign stuff. I know uh, I've been told, uh, they told me, as in the game told me, that this could, this is my last uh, base camp before, uh, you know, before I have to actually, like, my last base camp that I can actually do upgrades and everything beforehand. Uh, or even fast travel. So, um, I think we're pretty much ready. As ready as I can be. I didn't go out and do anything special. I just straight up just... Yeah. Uh, so let's do this. Okay. Let's go climb that damn freaking tower. Up we go. And jump. All right, what's going on here? Sounds like a war is coming. Well, we're in trouble. Just letting us talk. Press X to trigger radio signal. There we go. Hey! Help! Asshole. Oh, we're in trouble. Oh, we got no bullets. You know what? What do you guys got on me? Come on! Got assault rifle. This pulse fire seems to be helping a lot. Look at these guys just suddenly appear like that. That's so silly. Why would they just suddenly appear like that? I think I like the high ground. I'm gonna stick with the high ground here. This way they have to come to me. Oh, look at that fancy stuff. Oh, 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 fire, 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 fire. Uh oh. All right, outie, 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 out now. Kill him, kill him, kill him, finish him off, finish him off. Uh oh. Up, 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 up we go. Go this way. Dude, that's badassery. Look at that. And take some ammo. Oh, oh, oh. I need that. Thank you. Okay. Got what I got. Oh! Boom shakalaka! Again? This guy just cannot take it. Is that right? Okay. I can't climb nothing. 
Jesus, she's taking so many shots. I need some space here. Let him stop. Uh oh. Fuck, I missed it. Oh, did I actually hit him? Oh. It's like the whole fucking army against one. One V army. Let's go. Let's go. Want to fight? Get out of here. Finish you off. That. What do you think about that? Oh. Uh, okay. Um. Wow. Outy, outy, out now. Woo! No. Oh, I died. Oh my god. I was hoping I would just not die in this last part at all. Whatever this. Hold my ground, I guess. Get out of here. Wait. Take him out now. Aha! He's back! This guy is out to get us. This whole place is falling apart. I don't think I'm doing this right. We're ready when you are, Laura. Just Gotta wait for him to settle down here. There we go. Oh boy. Oh, oh boy. Down we go. Oh shit. Let's do this.
What else is out there? Oh, they don't know. Alright, I gotta take them out one at a time here. Them. Ah, oh, come on. No, I died. I want I actually part of I partially wanted to die there just because I wanted to do that stealth as best I could. I think it was a bad idea for me to go out there like that. Um It's like two, four of them, okay? Oh, I can't do that. Whoa! Didn't think that was gonna work. Well, I took two of them out. Hey, buddy! Hey, buddy! This guy's a hardcore. Are you serious right now? So much for stealth. That didn't go anywhere. Okay, got him. Oh, you're kidding me! Hi! Okay. Guess that wasn't gonna happen. Oh, is that what? The, oh, that was the way I was supposed to. <laughs> I hate when you figure things out later. It's like, oh, that's the way I was supposed to get from pla uh, from podium to podium. Damn. All right. That's GTFO here. Constantine's, of course, alive. I was half expecting him to crawl out of the exit there. No, don't take my bow. You son of a bitch. Uh oh. You can't hide. Come fight me. Don't hide the shadow. You're made of wrong stuff. I wonder. Did Got you. Oh, this guy's going down. This guy's an idiot. I was there, watching from the shadows. Uh, idiot. Whoa! Almost pushed the wrong button there. I'll take my bow back. 
And my weapons. For the record, you do this to yourself. It's not my destiny. I was meant for greatness. What the hell's wrong with him? This was never your destiny. Your sister let you believe that. I did it all. All of this. For her. Yeah, where did that get you? No, nope, she'll run. Trinity killed your father. No, you're lying. He begged for his life. And when that failed, he begged for yours. You're wrong. Shut up. Just shut up. He was. Hmm. So do we have an option here? Do I have to kill him or can I like leave? I like to think his last thoughts were of you, Laura. Of how he drove you away. How he had failed you. I don't know, should I kill him? He would have held you back. Yeah. Should be thinking. Uh, let's let's let him live. You're not worth Oh, he dies anyways. Okay, well. Burn it out. Whatever. Man still died. Let's get going. I feel like we've got like one more big puzzle ahead to handle. What is this? Is what are you holding? No, that's what Trinity has wrought. Death, and that's all I'll ever bring. Give this up. I gave up everything for this. I have no intention of giving it to Trinity. What about your father? You're dooming him to be mocked by history. How can you let this go when you're so close? I'm willing to make that sacrifice. I can't let you take it. Think of the millions suffering and dying. We can save them. We can change the world together. The cost is too high, Anna. We aren't meant to live forever. Death is a part of life. That's easy for you to say. You're not the one who's dying. But this isn't about you. This is about humanity, about protecting what it means to be human. They're coming. We're surrounded. You're dead. Jacob, look out! The source is not meant for the world. This is your chance, Lara. Everything I've done, everything you've done. Another croc doesn't have to die for this, but I'm willing to. Uh oh. Well, I'm not. Yeah, because that's going to stop them. doing Okay No It's okay If you break that doesn't he die Oh, they all die. Well, that's nuts. Jacob, hold on. <laughs> I've held on for 
too long already. Oh. You know I destroy it. In all my years, I've met few as extraordinary as you. Bye, Jacob. My dearest Lara, I often think about how my father would turn over in his grave if he knew the shame I had brought upon our family's name. Croft, what does it even mean? I just hope you can make your own mark on this world someday. Remember that the extraordinary is in what we do, not who we are. Destroying the source was the right thing to do. I still feel like it. Hey, Jenna! I think you would have made the same choice. Come on. You've got a plane to catch. Where are we headed to now? Listened to his last tape a thousand times, but it's as if I was hearing my father's words only now for the first time. It doesn't matter what choices he would have made, I have to make my own. The myth of Katesh was real. There are secrets out there that can change the world. I need to find them, not for my father, not for anyone else. Trinity is still out there, and they're more powerful than I ever imagined. I can stop hmm. them. I can make a difference. I can make the right difference. Hey! Alright! The game has been officially complete! Oh yeah! Bad, okay. Jeez, okay, so this game was definitely far longer than two, the first Tomb Raider game. I'm gonna have to say that, that's for sure. I mean, look at that, we're already, what, 34 parts in? And there's some DLC, I think, if I'm correct. There's some storyline in the DLC. I know at one point I did, uh, I did at some point kind of <laughs> did a little bit of the, the story, one of the DLC stories, uh, which I'll probably figure out, uh, I'll probably end up doing that a little bit later. As in, maybe the next part, I'll look into, uh, like, which one I should actually technically do first. If, I, if, if I'm correct, there's two story modes. I'm not quite, I'm not 100% sure uh, in regards to that. Um, something about a yabba dabba do or something? I don't know. I don't know! But, um, yeah, I don't know. I really enjoyed playing this game. I liked some of the changes. I liked, I didn't like some of the changes, like, other changes. Like, I don't know. I, I <laughs> off the top of my head, like... It's, it's kind of hard to remember exactly what I liked and didn't like. Uh, the swimming stuff was really cool. Uh, we, uh, wish to see maybe in the next game. Maybe some, some wildlife or something. Maybe get attacked by an alligator or something. I don't know. Just saying. Just saying. I was half expecting to see an alligator. Just somewhere. Anywhere. Everywhere. You know. You know what I mean? Um, it was definitely a... They definitely pushed, pushed what they could do with the Tomb Raider games. Uh, like from the first one, like I know the first one was definitely really cool, but this one, this one was like one of the few, one of the few like sequel type games that like actually really innovates upon the first game, which was definitely really cool to see. Um, what else can I? I love this. I like the story. Um, I kind of missed on. I, I kind of missed out on like some of the other characters. Like you know, I like. I wish I could have seen a little bit more of Jonah. I uh, finally got- I'm glad that he, he actually ended up saying Little Bird at some point, because I know that was something that he definitely kept saying in the first one. Um, character designs wise, um... I kinda like- I, I don't know what to say about, like, the- the... Like, w like, what they did with Jonah's character design, because they completely changed his, uh, his look from the first game. Um, till now. Lara looked- it looked- looked different. Um, the Ana thing? I wanna say it- somewhat caught me by surprise but kind of didn't at the same time it's like because the second the second we saw her sitting there in the chair and she looked perfectly fine when she was captured 
that was a dead giveaway that she was actually part of the that like she was part of the enemy team and like for me that was just okay then it just became okay well you know oh she's a bad guy what i think what kind of surprised me was more of okay this is a brother sister relationship here i was thinking like anna and uh constantine were like a um we were love interests, but that wasn't the case at all. It ended up being a brother-sister relation. Uh, do I like that? I'm not quite sure. I mean, I think I need to let it simmer for a bit or something, you know? Um, but yeah, uh, being able to do missions and stuff like that on the side, that was kind of cool, getting extra XP and stuff like that. I felt a little overwhelmed by the amount of stuff that was thrown in there. I have a feeling that might have something to do with maybe just the fact that I bought like the season pass or something and things kind of just were added um, like immediately if you know what I mean um so it's like all of a sudden I had like seven bow and arrows even though like I guess throughout the game maybe you get three or four um which is why I kind of just try to stick with whatever I kind of unlocked at at whatever time so uh, I guess that's why I stuck with like the compound bow whether or not that was actually technically part of the story I don't know um the idea of you being uh, being able to hunt more and and stuff like that and like the current like the whole system that they created to craft and stuff i found that to be a little overwhelming to be honest with you um i think they could have broke that in a little bit smoother it just felt like i don't know i just felt like all of a sudden i'm able to craft like all these things and i i didn't even know exactly what i needed um that was very apparent i wish i i wish i knew what i what i what i was doing in that regard the tombs i thought the tombs were great i thought they were challenging uh somewhat challenging um i got stuck on one of them for like 45 minutes i think but that's because like i didn't exactly think properly in that one uh i think it was the the water the water tomb I like I had a really good idea as to what I was supposed to do and then I just gave up on it because it just wasn't working and then I come back to it 45 minutes later and it turns out that was the way I was supposed to do it so yeah um I'm really excited I, I I'm always definitely excited when it comes to playing the Tomb Raider games and and actually completing a tomb because I, I don't know there's this really there's this crazy like satisfaction I get when I actually complete a tomb I'm just like I just sit there and just like yeah I did it like you know i didn't need no damn google's help or no youtube's help i did it like i figured this out on my own not that it was like not that they, they they made it like impossibly hard to do right when you really think about it it's like oh okay yeah okay that makes sense everything just makes sense um i know i know that they definitely like hid things so to speak if you know what i mean like it was like they were you have to definitely had to you have to have like an eye for detail definitely a vigilant eye there were definitely a couple of things that were like, um, like a small little handle here that you just wouldn't see, but you have to see it, like, in order to understand what's going on next, or like how to how to complete the the, the tomb, if that makes any sense. Like, I know there was one, there was one that was holding a bucket, and like I just couldn't see it until like another twenty minutes later, and then it just clicked to me. It's like, oh, that's a handle. Oh, I'm supposed to do this. Oh, okay, like you know, that that kind of stuff. Um, I feel like. I had to keep it a, a better eye on that. <laughs> um, I think that they're actually saying that there might be another Lara Croft Tomb Raider movie. Uh, sorry, not movie. Game coming out later on this year. Uh, if so, I'm pretty excited. Hopefully, uh, hopefully we'll see something soon in regards to that game. Um, I'm really excited to move on to some of the DLC stuff. See what changes they've made. In regards to like completing achievements and stuff or like completing the game as far as like other tombs that I haven't completed or any of the challenges I haven't completed uh, I'll see if I can just um, do some of it later on um, I know I'm kind of like busy right now with everything and with like the Tomb Raider movie around the corner I feel like you know I, I feel like we're hitting some some pretty good time in regards to um, in regards to actually completing this game how long is it gonna take me to do uh, the DLC stuff I don't even know how long it is so like I'm thinking maybe they just made it like small like like you know short maybe like enough to do like let's say six parts maybe three or four I feel like that's what they would do I know that's what the, the, the people have done in the DLC in the past like look, look at Star Wars for instance the Battlefront 2 series uh, sorry the Battlefront 2 game they had a DLC that maybe was like maybe three four parts long so yeah that was definitely cool uh, I just really want to. I just really want to see what, what what they have in store for us as far as DLC go. Is there a post credit scene? I don't think there is. Let's find out. Oh, there is. 
two weeks earlier. Anna. You said another craft doesn't have to die for this. What did you mean by that? I'm confused. You killed my father, didn't you? Trinity ordered his execution. I couldn't do it. You're lying. I loved him. No! Okay. It's done. Good. What about Croft? Hmm. Is that something that we're gonna, we're gonna be exploring in the DLC? I don't know. We'll find out. I'm glad there actually is like a post-credit scene here. That was definitely cool. Oh, uh, or is that a lead up to uh, part three or whatever the next uh, Tomb Raider game is? I don't know. We'll find out in the next video. I'm gonna have to wrap this up right here. I hope you enjoyed watching this content. If you did, give it a like. If you didn't, give it a dislike. Chime into the comment section below to let me know if you enjoyed this video or not. If you want to see more content from me, then go ahead and pulverize that subscribe button. I can't wait to see you all in the next video. Until next time.